Los Angeles is a huge city and there are so many different areas to visit. But if you are in downtown Los Angeles for the first time, you'll definitely want to explore a few iconic places. Here are our top four recommendations on things to do in downtown Los Angeles on your first visit. First stop, Little Tokyo. Start off your morning in Little Tokyo, which is the largest Japan town in the nation. Head to Yamazaki Bakery for breakfast and indulge in a freshly baked meronpan. It's a delicious sweet bread that goes great with coffee. After your breakfast, take a walk around Japanese Village Plaza and explore all the stores and restaurants. Pop Killer is one of our favorite shops with a wide variety of trendy accessories and clothes. Next, check out the Japanese American National Museum, which is dedicated to preserving the history and culture of Japanese Americans. The museum shares powerful World War II stories of Japanese Americans who were forced into incarceration camps from 1942 to 1946. For lunch, head over to downtown's landmark, the Grand Central Market. This market is filled with an array of cuisines including Japanese, German, Chinese, Mexican, American barbecue, and so much more. Our favorite stops here were Ramen Hood and PBJ LA. We're huge fans of ramen, so we had to try the 100% vegan ramen at Ramen Hood. We were a bit skeptical at first, but very surprised at how delicious the ramen was. It's probably one of the best ramens we've had in Los Angeles and just couldn't believe it was 100% vegan. PBJ LA is a great stop for a snack. They offer classic and unique peanut butter and jam sandwiches. All of their nut butters, jams, and milks are house made from scratch with organic ingredients. We went with the new school sandwich that used almond butter instead of peanut butter. Number three, The Last Bookstore. The Last Bookstore is a fun stop if you are in downtown LA, especially if you're a book lover. It is California's largest used and new bookstore with over 250,000 books on two floors. It has grown in popularity over the years because of its clever way of shaping books for fun photo ops like the book tunnel. There are also unique art installations using books as well. It's such a creative space and you can tell the owner, Josh Spencer, has a huge passion for books. Lastly, head over to Bradbury Building. This building is located directly across the street from the Grand Central Market. This is a historical landmark in downtown LA and it was built in 1893. The skylit atrium and the ironwork of the stairs are magnificent. You're not allowed to take pictures inside with your camera, but you can take pictures with your iPhone. There is so much more to do in downtown LA, but if you're a first timer visiting the area, these are the spots you must hit. Enjoy your time in sunny California. If you like this video, please give it a thumbs up. And if you want to watch more of our videos, please subscribe to our channel. Don't forget to hit the bell icon as well so you can get notifications as soon as our new content goes live. Thanks for watching and we'll see you back here next time.